urban combat. Do you, do you feel empowered by your urban combat? By empowered, do you mean do I want to strangle the employer? Yeah, it took a little damage in there. We're in urban mix. What the hell else were we going to do? That didn't actually take damage. That just got the armor blown off. So did the leg. The, uh, the structure did not actually get damaged. Oh, good. They gave us a piece of one. That, that's what I needed for this. A piece of an urban mech. Absolutely. Now can I land the Annihilator down there and just start shooting things? It's funny you should ask that. Yang. God damn it, Yang. Yang, we, we could win this tournament, yes. But, um, they're making me pilot goddamn urban mechs to do this. Throwing up more red flags in a Cretan military parade. That's a good way to put it. Very, that's an excellent way to put it. Subdermal mic, okay. <laughs> Ministry of Information, Intelligence, and Operations. Yep, she's an employer of Quintus, an employee of Quintus Allard. He also wants to marry his fur coat. <laughs> kind of figured that much. I mean, mm. will he use a spear? I'm listening. <laughs> I mean, the money's nice and all. Yeah, this is kind of the point. So, so we're about to get the uh, decision point here. I'm I'm good with accepting Davian's offer. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm very good with accepting Davian's offer.
I don't I don't even have to drop my heaviest lance down there. I can drop 400 tons. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Considering what the rest of this mission's been like, that is a pleasant surprise, so not to get that cliche. Yeah. Okay. So let's see where is my man. <coughs> there we go. Old reliable. Yep. It says the difficulty still only two skulls. Yeah, I'm pretty sure like the like it'll drop things other than urban mechs. Um there'll be more urban mechs showing up than we were going to fight originally, but there'll be things other than urban mechs. I don't think they're that large though. I mean, so far, I mean, the, this tournament is urban mechs and more urban mechs. So, yeah, the pilot might have some skill, but does he actually have a mech to, to a pilot? He has the urban mech, the greatest mech in existence. You know, I may not actually shoot the urban mechs. I may just hunt them down and step on them. It would take a lot of AC-10 rounds to punch through my annihilator, that's all I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Well, well, about that. Oh, was the second round the AC-20 variants? Uh, there, there are some of those, yes. Among other things. It's still got to get in range. Mm -hmm. Oh, absolutely. This goddamn flashpoint. <laughs> Hey, you're pink. About that. Uh -huh. <laughs> You're all pink. Defeat tournament finalists. Okay. Oh, we don't really have any good place to take cover, so... Copy that. Is that enemy con? Urban mech. We're no, okay, we're still not in Don't combat mode twice. yet. Move order received. I'm nuclear. Good job. You you tried. Waiting on you, Commander. Yeah, 
That's another Irby over there. Uh huh. Yeah, that only has the AC-10 on it. Yeah, that, that one does. <laughs> you destroyed everything. I I literally think the only thing that survived was the head. Okay, let's see who's out there. Another urban mag. A blackjack. A centurion. You're you're quaking in your boots now. Oh yeah, I'm I'm absolutely terrified. Can you tell? <laughs> Two Irby's, a centurion, and a blackjack. What's up, boss? Move into position. Potato. Potato. Urban potato. Good to go. That was the centurion, by the way. Yeah, yes, but it was still an urban potato. Okay. That's the leader of this whole thing up there, isn't it? Um, it's either the leader or that, yeah, his that's enforcer. Mincius. Okay, that's Mincius. The the Centurion had Calamar Gigante in it. <laughs> uh, Do you think Mincius regrets life choices right about now? He's about to. If he does, I hope he got the regret Order. over with quickly because I don't think there was much left to re much left uh, of to him to regrets. regret anything. It's the big gun, Urban Vic. You missed. Waiting for orders. On my way. This is good. Gotcha. How's it going? <laughs> On one hand, we did good things for House Davian. On but the other, 
At least it wasn't Lady Cunningham. Yeah. We, we might be able to help you get out of that prison cell, I'm just saying. Mission successful. <sighs> Tournament of Champions. Do, do you feel like a champion now? No. No, I do not. I feel dirty. Well, you clearly should have done the tournament in Urban Mechs. No, I feel dirty because it was in an Urban Mech. But it's the greatest mech ever! You mean the greatest punishment ever? I would take an Urban Mech over a Cicada or a Vulcan. I mean, I would too. That doesn't mean I want to be in one anytime soon. Decent AC-20. That's about the only thing really worth much here. I mean, I might as well take it. I mean, there's literally nothing else here to take. Oh, good, thanks. I wanted those. I mean, I can understand how normal tournaments you'd want to standardize the mix. Not allow people to bring in their super fancy, you know, pimped out freaking annihilators. I get that. The thing is, Solaris is absolutely all about bringing in the flashiest custom mechs that you can, but... Oh! Well, we still didn't have to talk to Lady Cunningham. Oh, thank God. Have ours. <laughs> no, really, we're good. You you don't have to do this. <laughs> You're standing at the top and slipping a little there, Yang. <laughs> Between Yang's big score and this. <laughs> I mean, you have a fair point, but on the other hand, I don't think there's any way to know anymore. That's Darius's job. Yep. Okay. Decent gyros. So yeah, plus three melee hit in that gyro. Not bad. I might find a place... It doesn't take any tonnage, so I might just stick it in the awesome. It just takes up three slots. Doesn't take up any tons. Okay. 
And, and look, look what we now have a complete, fully working version of. I'll I'll put it under my desk for the to file paperwork I don't care about anymore. In <laughs> it's the Sparrowson. If I ever pick one up and decide to name it, that might be its name now. <laughs> Since I am here. You're, you're telling Star we found a Sparrowson, aren't you? No, I'm not, actually. She's asleep. Ah. Our mod plus. <laughs> yeah, that was a problem. The, the uh, bigger, better arm mods took up actual weight. Yeah. See, that gyro is just... It reduces stability and damage. This one, on the other hand... Gives you extra melee. Hmm. Not, not that we've used the strong mad recently, but... No, but if we do, we I mean, we've got a melee mech here, so... Yep. Granted, it's a melee mech with three PPCs in it. Weirdest melee mech, but we love it anyway. On it. I'll let you know when that's done. There we go. Of all Urban the flashpoints, of all the flashpoints, that was certainly one. <laughs> at, at least we didn't have to, like, do genocide or anything. Yeah. Or, like, shoot hostages. Yeah. Yeah. But, with, with the uh, flashpoint down, good grief, yawn hit me right there, didn't it? Hmm. With that flashpoint down, it is time to take a break, so when we come back, we'll, we'll pick one of the other flashpoints and hope we don't have to pilot freaking urban mechs again. All, all missions are only urban mechs from now on. God damn it. Mwahaha. But until then, take care, everyone. Bye-bye, and...